Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Um, welcome to the Project Production Institute, eighth annual symposium. Today we're joined by people from all over the world. So thank you for joining us. My name is Roberto Arbulu, and I will be your facilitator today for the entire day. This year, the theme of the symposium is modern construction. And by modern construction, by construction, we mean the entire engineering and construction industry and its ecosystem, okay? We have, our intent today is that we focus on defining why we need to modernize construction. What are the implications to the industry and what other people are doing, how they're approaching modern construction, what they're learning about it, and expand on how the industry can actually adopt modern construction. I can tell you one thing, we're very, very excited this year because we believe this topic, the discussion today is gonna to have a significant impact on the entire engineering and construction industry. So please stay tuned with us throughout the day. For those of you, for those of you who are joining the symposium for the first time or are connected with PPI recently, we wanna highlight a couple of things. One, the Institute was actively formed in year 2013 and a year after, as you can see here, it actually organized its first symposium in December, 2014 in San Francisco. Since then, hundreds of professionals around the world throughout the years have actually joined PPI symposiums, typically organized toward the end of the year, like this one, since 2014. Because of COVID, what we were forced to do is to conduct last symposium in 2020 virtual, and as well as this one this year, uh, but PPI is considering looking at an in-person, going back to an in-person format for next year and years after. Let me take you through what is the plan for the day? What are we trying to achieve today? We're gonna to start with Gary Fisher, PPI Executive Director, providing us with a PPI update, what PPI has been doing, some announcements, different efforts that PPI has been conducting last year and what also brings for the future. That will take us until 9.30 Central. Todd Sabell will share PPI's perspective on modern construction, more specifically, what is it? How to make it happen? Todd is gonna take about 15 minutes to frame a, the conversation which will be very important for the rest of the day today. Todd will be followed by Gary moderating a panel conversation with a, a variety of professionals, very seasoned professionals from companies like McKinsey, ASRI, PPI as well, Collier's Project Leaders and Chevron on why construction needs to transform. As you can see here, we're gonna spend an hour and 15 minutes on this panel discussion and get really, really deep on why construction needs to transform. But then we will switch. We will switch to different sessions that will start sharing more details about what, what, how specific companies, leading companies are actually going through this journey to modern construction. We will start with Hess and Petronas that will take us until noon central time. Then we will go for a break and we will continue after 12.30 central time with a, the same topic. We will have a, a very interesting perspective on how some production management approaches have been applied to a COVID vaccination program, as well as Microsoft sharing their own story and journey in terms of modern construction. That will take us until 1.30 p.m. Central Time. 
Then we will have Autodesk sharing their vision for industrial light construction and how this contribute to, or how industrial light construction is an element also of modern construction until 2 p.m. in the afternoon central time. James Chu will moderate a, a conversation with Autodesk, BP, McKinsey and Company, PPI and SPS on different perspectives associated with the journey to industrialized construction, what is currently being done, how companies are actually seeing the future and very important ideas associated with the, what you should consider when in your own journey to industrialized construction. Todd Sabell will then uh, become the moderator for a discussion with Stanford, Cloud Leaf, and Chevron on the future of autonomous and digital in construction. This will be the last session of the day, and it will take us until 425, which then Gary Fisher will be conducting closing remarks for about five minutes before we, we wrap it up. Okay, so that is the plan for the day. For those of you who would like to get a, or follow this in more detail, you can always go to the Project Production Institute website, projectproduction.org, and you will go to events and have access to the entire agenda with the different topics. But before we get going with the, the day, let me highlight a few logistical details for everyone attending today. First of all, because we have only one session, we don't have any parallel sessions, there's only one Zoom link, the same link that is gonna be used for the entire day. You should have received it via email, obviously is the one you're using now, but you can always go back to the PPI website and get that link. If for some reason you have to leave us and then reconnect, please continue using the same link. Also, it's important to highlight that at the bottom of your screen, there is a Q&A feature, questions and answers feature that we encourage you to use during all the sessions today to share your perspective, your questions, and we will, an entire PPI team will share those with the panelists, with the speakers. A brief message to the speakers, panelists, and moderators, please follow verbal cues, my verbal cues, so we ensure an effective transition from session to session without any disruption. And finally, something that I wanna to bring to your attention, this session is being recorded. PPI will make these sessions available on the PPI website after this symposium. And so that's also a reference for you and all the colleagues if you're interested to get access to this symposium today.